Hi, and welcome back to Budgeting by Dina, U.S. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're working on Detective Dina today. We're going to see if we could solve any crime today. I know we got uh, a little bit more to go. We found out some clues. But anyway, let me get my tools ready, and we're going to get out and start investigating. And I want to say hi to a few people. Uh, we got Detective Donna over at uh, the Stuff Cashing Realtor. We've got uh, Detective B with B's Budget. And we're all working on this together. And we got Detective Andra with the tr sales and traveling chief. No, the saving and traveling chief. Anyway, the clues that we have found out so far is the uh, suspect has is a female with blonde hair. And they broke into a closed Starbucks. And it happened on New Year's Eve. So we've got that figured out, and we've got a few more clues here we got to get, and hopefully we can find out who did this today. So let's go ahead and get our nine-sided dice and get rolling. All right, we got a six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Good, we got one. And here is my secretive magnifying glass that I use as a scratching tool. Okay, this was not a good turn. Because we got a female, which does not line up for anything. Let's see. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's try this one. And this here is a blonde female. So we're still not any closer to the suspect. We only have two more. And remember, these are $2 each. So I'll pay when I'm done. We got a six again. A three. One, two, three. We're rolling good today. Okay, and this is not good. All right. Let's go. Well, I don't need to roll. We know the last one's a seven, so let's go ahead and get that one. And we got the suspect. The suspect is a blonde head in a white dress. So there we go. We got it. We found out another clue today. Great job. I can't wait to tell my father about that. Since I got this detective agency after him. So let's see. We got five, six, seven, and eight for finding out who the suspect was. And we're going into my, <coughs> excuse me, my crime solving binder. And we're going to see how much we collected on the who. See how much it took for us to get through this job. Paying our informants, we'll see what's left. All right, for the who, this is what we got. We got 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. So for the who, we got $44. All right, so we're a little closer there. Let's see what else we've got to play in here. Let's see, we got the wear. We still got quite a few wares to go. So let's go ahead and roll our dice and see how much we got to add in here. Let's see, a three, which is Germany. Let's see, one, two. Somebody took a bite out of that dollar. Now it's just folded back. Okay, so there's three. Let's keep going. A five which is Spain. Let's see, another five, which is Spain again. <clears throat> Have you guys gotten anywhere on this one yet? A one, which is USA. A four. Let's put this dollar back and grab a five. And put the five back and grab a 10. My binder's getting a little full. Let's do another one. Number four. Okay. I'm going to stop there for now. We might come back to this. And let's see how much we got here. We got two fives that I'm going to cash in for a ten. And this one here, you can save whatever you want. You can tally it or put the value here. I'm just saving what I roll. So here we got 10, 20, 21, 22 today. We're doing pretty good. Let's go ahead and see what we got in there so far. Okay. 
So for my wear, we've got, this one's a big one. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we got $107 in the wear. And we might finish this one today. I'm not sure. It depends on how far we go. So we run out of money. If I have anything left today, we'll put that in tomorrow's randomizer. So let's see what the next one is. Okay, we already know what offense it is. It is uh, broke into a closed Starbucks. When we have New Year's Eve. And then we got the Y. And I want to go ahead and finish this. If you guys will give me a chance. I got my cards out. I hit them from the cleaning lady. So I know where they're at today. Okay. Let's just give this a, a quick. Alright. Let's see. The first one is a spade. A spade is $4. So one, two, three. And four. We got to get our black marker. I don't know where my black marker is. Somebody ate it. So we're going to use a blue for a spade. All right. Let's pull another one. We got a diamond. All right. Let's see. A diamond is $2. Alrighty. So let's see. Diamonds two dollars. Let's see. Will this be a heart? Nope. It's another spade. Alright. A spade again is four dollars. So let me put one of these back and grab a five. Come on, be something different. A diamond. <laughs> We're stuck with these. At least we're going to figure out why today. I want to hit another clue. And we got a puppy toe. A puppy toe is $3. And I just wiped that off. So we got three. And let me do the puppy toe. All right. And let's see. We got another puppy toe. That's $3 again. Okay, one more, guys. We're getting down to the end of this. Let's see, we got a jack, a joker. So we got a diamond again. All right, now diamond is $2. All right, let's count them up and see what we got here. Put these off to the side. All right. Let's see. So hearts. Let's see, hearts, we got one, two. Oh, boy. Hearts didn't come out. We must have been hiding them. Let's see, diamonds, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, puppy toes, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So, right now, diamonds are in the lead. Let's see if spades can pull it off. We got one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So diamonds are winning. Let's go ahead and scratch this off and see why the why the crime occurred. So we're doing diamonds. Let's see. Has anybody else figured out their why yet? I think one person has completed this game so far. All right, we got a jewelry heist gone wrong. Now, why would they have jewelry in Starbucks unless there's something counterfeit going on? We're going to have to figure that out. So, we got the Y. Let's see how much we got today. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, let's cash that in for a 10. And we're going to go ahead and add this up and see what we got for the Y. Let's see. 1... All right, let's see, we got 10. I'm finding out some clues. Maybe we'll finish this. 
All right, so why we got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, and 92. So we're collecting really good in this one. Put that back in my binder. I told you nobody would find that. And then we're on to the how it happened. Let's see which one we're going to get first. Number six. We're down here in pencil. Okay, so let me get another dice so we can roll two at a time and save, save a little bit of time. All right, let's see what we got. We got a two and a four. So two and a four, which is a miss, and four and two. All right. Let's see. Four and two and two and four. Yeah. Okay, a four and a one. And a one and a four. So that's two misses again. I think this is going to be the death of me. Let's see. We got two and one. One and two. We got that. Oops, I'm sorry. Two and one. Okay, so we got two and five, which is a miss. And five and two. Oh, we got a clue. The eye. Yes. So we got one on each board. We still got a ways to go. Let's keep rolling. See what. Oop. Get my dice. Okay. A one and a six. All right. We got two clues. A P and an I. Let's see. A one and a six and one and six. We got an L. So we got three more spaces to get. Let's see if we can crack this case today. Let's see. One and a two. And a two and a one. We are, that number keeps coming out. Okay, a six and a two. A two and a six. That's two misses. We were doing good there for a little bit. Let's see. All right, a six and a five. Let's see. A six and a five and a five and a six. We got a five and a three. Okay. All right. Come on. A four and a two. That's a miss again. Is anybody out there having any better luck than me on this one? Let's see. A four and a three. All right. We got a C. And a three and a four. All right. So that's a hit. That's two dollars. Come on. Two more work letters. <clears throat> Let's see, a two and a five. We got the E. Yes. One more. And let's see, a two and a five we got. So that's another hit. I'm going to call my special informants out. A two and a one again. Let's see, a four and a two. And two and a four we got. Come on, we need some threes. Come on, three. Can't roll a three to save my life. Wow. A one and a six. I'm just rolling now, trying to figure this one out. A four and a four. I'm running out of ones here, and I brought extra ones out today. A five and a two. Got it. We're playing coverall. Let's see, a five and a three, we got it. A six and a two. We're just going to keep rolling until we hit a three and a something. Come on, three and something. That three don't want to come out. Okay, I'm going to do the thing, calling my informant. And we got the last clue of an N, and we're going to put a hit in here. So we know it's been done by pencil. So the weapon was a pencil. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Boy, it took a lot to find out that clue. So we got five, ten, and fifteen. Alrighty, let's go ahead and add this in. Do you guys want me to add the total together? All right. All right, I think we're going to... I got one more clue, I think. 10, 20, 30, 40, 
45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, and 86. So let me go ahead and get five ones out of here and grab another five. We'll go ahead and count this all when we finish the game. All right. Let's go back. We're, we only got one more clue to get, so let's go back and finish it up. Let's see. Right here, we got four rolls. So let's go ahead, Mama, and see what we got. A two. This one might take a little while to add up. Let's see. A two. A two. That two's really coming out now. Two more. Last roll. Come on. A five. All right. Let me set this off to the side. We'll count it up and find out where this happened. Okay. So ones, we've got one. So we know it didn't happen in the United States. Oops. Putting that in the wrong place. A number two, we got one, two, Three, four, five. And that's Mexico. Okay, number three is Germany. We've got one, two, three, four, five, five. So we know it didn't. It, it might be a tie. France, we got four. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so France is in the lead. Let's check on Spain. Spain is number five, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Spain's coming in close third. Let's try Italy, and this will be the last one, number six, which wasn't a lead for a while. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, so we know that it happened in France. So let's go ahead and... Put this all together and see what kind of crime we had. We finished up. Okay, so we got a blonde-headed lady that did this. And I'm going to name her uh, Donna. <laughs> and it did happen in France. And they broke into a closed Starbucks. And it happened on New Year's Eve. And it was a jewelry heist gone wrong. We don't know why they were in Starbucks because they don't sell jewelry there. Of course, you could buy it if you could afford their coffee. You could afford their drinks. You could afford some jewelry. And then we finally found out the weapon. They did it with a pencil. All right, let's go ahead and figure out what we've done and how much we've collected. Let me go ahead and put this back in here. All right, let's get it all out and see how much it costs to finish this case. And we're all done with Detective Dina, and she's going to go on vacation now, because this was a tough case, but we figured it out. Got a big stack there. Let's see what we got. Give me a minute to... Don't know how to fast-forward my camera, so we're going to just have to... Let's see. I don't think I got any 20s in here. So let's... Okay. Just separate this money. Maybe this will pay for my vacation. Does anybody got anything exciting going on this weekend? Let me know down in the comments. Maybe you give me some ideas. I got to run up to the post office in a few minutes and get some of my packages out. And if you, you don't mind, if you got time, go over to, to Etsy and favorite some of my items because my sales are back down again. I don't know why. I keep putting out cute little items. All right, here we go. And I got my faithful calculator out. Okay, we got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 210. Wow, I didn't think I had this much money. Okay, so we got 210, 
Wow, we got a lot of fives. Let's see, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So we got 135. So we'll add that in. All right, and then we got the ones. And boy, I hate counting ones. I think everybody does. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we got ten, twenty, thirty, nine. So let me add 39. All right. In order to solve this crime, we've come up with a total of $384. That is just absolutely wonderful. And we did this in what, four or five weeks, Marion? But anyway, I'm going to take and put this towards my hotel stay for my cruise. And we got this done. We thank you for the opportunity to play this, Marion. And I'll put a link for this book down below. And remember... Just because I came up with those answers doesn't mean you will. There's different variations in every book. But now that I've finished, I'm going to go ahead and enter her giveaway for the $50 Etsy gift card. All right, guys. You have a great weekend. Enjoy yourself. Hit the like button. And you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.